Hello, hello, my sweeties. This is Candy Girl, and oh my god, it's like totally the 80s again. What? <laughs> like, yeah, it's the 80s again. Like, oh my god. Yes. Oh my god, this is gonna be like a totally Dollar Tree haul. Like, yeah, what else? It's a Dollar Tree haul. <laughs> and I've got my totally 80s rocking little material girl whatever outfit on the hair is big and poofy and blonde and we've got my little pink bow we've got my gloves we've got my blue eyeshadow the pink lipstick the earrings oh my god and the best part the totally 80s outfit sh uh, shirt and I'm even wearing pink leggings. Like what? <laughs> so this is an awesome 80s themed, themed um, um, Dollar Tree haul. Duh. <laughs> like, duh. I can't even think. <laughs> Hosted by Mimi Sparkles and Rose from The Rose Life. So awesome. They thought it'd be fun to like go back to the eight to the eighties for a little bit. So excuse me if I'm a little duh ditzy. Guys, what do you see in the background? Hello? What? This is my room. Oh my god. I am finally back in my pink bedroom. Okay, so it's a little bit of a mess, I know. But like I got so excited. I'm here for like a couple of days on and off. I'm finally back in my house yes not like for good for good but i'm in my room because like wow my roommate like you know was using my room as a storage locker for a little bit while i was gone for one whole one whole freaking year guys imagine being away from your house for a year when it's not even when you're like it's not beyond your control you know so yeah so i'm here because i've been vaccinated my roommate's been vaccinated so it's all good finally back home i have accumulated so much stuff my room is crazy. So, yeah. So, as I said, it's not looking so neat. But, you know, everything is still kind of in its place. I've got bags everywhere because I've been buying stuff, of course, throughout the year while I was at my boyfriend's house. And, like, t giving stuff to my roommate and saying, hey, put this in my room. Put this in my room and stuff like that. So, you know, for the next week or two, whatever it is, you know, I've got a lot of things to do. Stuff in my boyfriend's house to come back and forth and Tons of Barbie dolls, so many things to take care of. So until I can actually sleep in my pink paradise bed, you know, I'll still be like staying, you know, in my boyfriend's for, you know, whatever. So maybe like the second week of June or something like that, I'll be able to sleep in my own bed. But this is awesome. So I'm so glad I'm happy that I can do my first Dollar Tree haul back at home in an 80s style. Yes. Woo. So before I get into my haul, I just want to thank you all for being here and being a part of my sweet family. Thank you, thank you, thank you all so very much for being here and rocking with me. So yeah, um, happiness all around. Visit Mimi Sparkles and The Rose Life. Two awesome ladies who love the 80s as well. Uh, a couple of other women. Uh, I don't know if they... I know um, Andrea from Queen Bee Andrea did it. And a couple of other ladies did this awesome cool themed 80s challenge i was like oh my god i gotta do this so could the hair be any fluffier like for real like totally this is like so much hair <laughs> so basically you had to find at least three things from dollar tree that reminded you of the 80s once again sorry for the mess i know there's like stuff everywhere but you don't even see the rest of what i'm looking down here <laughs> but at least i found a space to sit my pink stool is still here so i found some stuff so you're supposed to find three things that reminded you of the 80s I have it right here. Let me get it. So, Aquanet. Yeah, Aquanet was the thing, okay? You wanted big hair like this. I did not wear my hair like this back in the day because I didn't have this kind of hair. <laughs> but uh, I did not wear my hair like this, but I always wanted to. I always wanted to be like the Black Madonna. <laughs> so I tried my best what I did with whatever I had going on with my hair. I think I would put my hair in like in ponytails and just put like the biggest bangs and spray it and all that business like that. So I didn't find the Aquanet. I did find, I don't know, Salon Selectives. I don't remember if that was popular in the 80s. But anyway, mousse, 
uh, and it's a really pretty packaging. It's all day plumping mousse. Mousse was popular then. I did use mousse and hairspray, but I couldn't find the Aquanet. So um, here we go. So it's a really pretty packaging, pink plumping mousse, because you got to put the mousse in the hair to make it just as big. Yes. So we have this pretty mousse. And then we have some, I don't know if it's necessarily 80s style, maybe a little bit, but look at the pink sunglasses, guys. What? What? So we have some nice, pretty, I have so many sunglasses over there ready, but I don't have this one because it's 80s style. So look at the pretty pink 80s style sunglasses. Yeah. Like, hello. Am I like not cool? Like seriously. <laughs> so yes, I'm loving these glasses. Super cool, super 80s. I'm going to take them off though because like, I can't even see, but I want you guys to see my blue eyeshadow. Know what I'm saying? See? Hello. <laughs> so something I was really popular when I was a kid in the 80s was jump roping. I used to love jump roping. We used to jump rope in my backyard a lot at school and all that business. So you know what? I found me a jump rope. And this is the kids one. I am a short, short girl. I'm five foot one. So hopefully this will be long enough. It says it's seven feet. So it should work. <laughs> so a pink jump rope you know i had to get pink and this was in the kids section so yeah and look at how pretty it is like iridescent on the handles and stuff now i cannot be doing this in the house unless i have a lot of space and i certainly don't have no space in this room my living room oh my god it's a shambles that's my roommate's room he sleeps in there and oh my god so yeah i totally will not be officially here for a while we have a lot of cleaning up to do, but it's just still still feels good to be home. You know what I'm saying? So we got, I got the jump rope. They have the blue, and they also have the green. So yeah, so 80s. <laughs> and I guess last but not least, y'all remember painting my numbers or painting in those little books? Well, I remember. And look, yes, it's pink. Oh my God, everything just happens to be pink. Why not? Duh. <laughs> this is the Animal Rescue Paint painting kitties um book i remember buying these like almost i don't know once a month or whatever you know these in my little um supermarket which was not far from my house we used to buy these little painting little books and then you would like add water you take a little cheapy little paintbrush i don't know if i have one here i might have one here a little paintbrush okay i think i got one yay i have one these little paintbrushes like that you would just kind of like dip it in like a cup of water and you would paint because the paint is kind of like built in there and then you paint it you know everything's built in all you need is water <laughs> so i thought this was like super cute to use but this totally reminded me of the 80s and then you know i even had barbie ones i totally had barbie ones those were so cool i used to have barbie like coloring books and sticker books they were made just like this like cheapy and they had a lot of them. They even had like, like uh, Betty and Veronica, the Archies and all the stuff like that. Katie Keene. Oh my God, totally. <laughs> so this is another like cute, I'm surprised they even had this. This was so cool. Just add water. Yep. There we go. So yeah, you just dip it in water, you paint it and the color starts to come out because those little things like that, that's the color. So super cool. Y'all remember that? I totally do because I totally did it. <laughs> so that is cool. So that is that for the 80s theme stuff. Like totally, let's get into the regular Dollar Tree haul. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, acetone. Like, okay. Oopsie, dropping stuff. Acetone is not always the easiest to find at Dollar Tree, but I found some. And 100% acetone. Yeah, because I use these for my nails, but I also use this for other projects where I am actually shrinking doll heads. Yeah, <laughs> I'm shrinking doll heads. It's a thing like a, like a, what is it? It's like crafting for dolls in the doll collectors community where like you say your doll has like brats. Y'all know brats dolls? Yeah, I'm kind of like a human brat, like totally. Big head and all. <laughs> big head, big hair. Oh, like right here. Here is a brat. And she's got a big head. But I like her the way she is. I'm not going to shrink her head. But I've already done it with a couple dolls. And you use acetone to shrink the doll's heads. I'm going way too deep. 
Anyway, I got two bottles of acetone. Great for your shrinking heads. Yes. <laughs> so that's that. Then I found something super cool. Hello. Thumbs up this video. <laughs> so this is my second thumbs up little statue. I have another one that I got from Dollar Tree that I had customized. It was actually for like graduates, like a thumbs up thing. And I shall show you guys. So this one that I had, it was black and it said world's greatest dad or whatever. Okay, it was for Father's Day. So I painted that, added some stuff onto it. So, but this one actually is just a thumbs up by itself. So this is super cool. Thumbs up this video, like totally. Okay. <laughs> so that was cool. It's all white. So yeah, I don't know if you could paint it because of the it's glossy paint, but it's white, like an off-whiter. So it could go with any decor. And then, oh my God, something I have been wanting forever. These pedestals. Oh my God, they finally had it. And they had the round one. They had the square ones too. They had black, but oh my God, I've wanted these forever. Finally got them in. So happy. <laughs> so happy I finally got those. Okay, so more stuff. Masks. Oh my God, yeah, we still got to wear masks. But they, I've never seen black masks at Dollar Tree. They always had the blue ones and the white ones. Now they have the black ones. Yes. And they are black on both sides. This is just a two-pack. This is actually my boyfriend's, but I took it from his Dollar Tree bag for my haul. Because I just wanted to show you guys. So, yes. You know, some places, you know, this, I mean, yeah, it's okay. You know, you got to wear masks still. You know, even if you're vaccinated, all that kind of stuff like that. Just, you know, do what you got to do. But in any case, a lot of the essentials that were hard to find, like last year at this time, like, you know, they got the Lysol, the alcohol, all that stuff is back in the store. So, yeah, I remember last year. Like, they were selling Lysol for, like, $15, $20 a can. Oh, unbelievable. So, pot holder. I think I might have had this one before, but not from Dollar Tree. Red, because my kitchen here is a red theme. So, this pot holder like that, this is like a rectangle with the rubber. I love that. And so, yeah. Really nice to have a pot holder. Totally. A lot of stuff is pink themed. Y'all got to remember, I'm a pink girl. I mean, hey, look at my messy bedroom. <laughs> okay, so this I found to be cute. Microfiber, microfiber hair wrap. There's a little button thingy on the top. So, yeah. I guess you wrap it around like there. If you're going to wash your hair, put your hair up, whatever it is. So, yeah. So, that is cool to have when you wash your hair or whatever it is you're doing. More pink. The um, Sure Sense Berry Blast. I love these sprays. Oh my God. I gotta, I'm gonna spray one right now because it is. I'm just still in shock. I'm doing a Dollar Tree haul in my room. Like, for real? This is so crazy. See, now I like broke the thing off by accident. <laughs> anyway, this one's a good sign. I was gonna spray it, but this is a good one. It smells really good. And y'all, if you don't break these things off, you can actually use this as a regular spray if you don't have the automatic sprayer. So you can use that either way. And let me try it just to make sure I don't spray it on myself. There we go. Uh huh. Yes. There we go. Smells awesome. So yeah, we have the. Uh, I have the automatic sprayer. I'm gonna leave this one here for my roommate because he doesn't have any. We just gotta put batteries in it. And I'll do that later. So my boyfriend has got plenty of these at his house. So. You know I had to get one for the roomie. Okay, so this is not from Dollar Tree, but I had to, I got it from, oh, where did I get this from? A local discount store, D2, where they have a lot of, like, stuff for the house. I just thought these are super cute, so I just wanted to include these in the haul. And these are really cute um, bags. <laughs> you know, I love these bags. They're sweet. Theme. I think these are... 59 cents each. Oh my God. And you could use this for so many things. They're nice and stiff too. And I like to carry extra little bags around just, be, you know, to carry whatever I'm carrying around. Lately, if I'm putting my mask and my sprays in here, whatever, just whatever you want to carry around. Sometimes you just, you know, your purse ain't big enough. <laughs> so yeah, look at how cute these are. Oh my God. Candies and cakes and sweets all over. Pink and glittery. I got two of the pink ones. And I've got a cute a blue, off bluish color one, whatever. So, yes, that is pretty. 
that's super cute those are 59 cents each as i said at my local discount store and i love it because it's thick it's got like a nice um thicker cardboard bottom okay back to the hole whoopsie you know the teeth gotta watch them teeth when you go outside you know what i'm saying placards i love these i haven't had these in a while because you know i didn't really think wasn't buying them because i wasn't doing much dining like i didn't do any indoor dining until finally a few days ago it was so weird doing indoor dining like something i'm so used to doing before the pandemic i was eating like in a spanish restaurant I had the most awesome grilled pork chop. Oh. oh my god i totally wanted the rice but no rice doing keto so yeah with the pork chop and the salad were awesome so anyway the placards so now back now that we're going to be doing our diet indoor dining and all that so we have these placards with the little mini brushes awesome to have I've got a super cute pin. I'm the, I don't really care for flamingos, but it was pink and it has a little gold crown and I love pink and gold. So I had to get this for my pin collection. I don't know if it works, but hey, and it has the cap. Yes. Then I got this super pretty um, heart, pink and white heart bath bomb, but I don't use those for a bath. I just like to put it in my like little pretty basket so that it looks pretty. Then we have some Dynamo Color cap Catching Sheets. You put this in your laundry just in case, you know, you're too lazy to take your pinks and your blacks and separate them. So, yeah, like my boyfriend is, does that. <laughs> oh, so, yeah. But color catching white thingies and, um, like, sheets. You put it in your laundry and that will help in case you mess up somewhere. And I also got me a ta -da! American flag fan. I love fans. I've been collecting fans like for a while and I always have one of the right color. Oh, it's hot in here right now, actually. <laughs> uh, for whatever outfit, whatever occasion. So, yes. Red, white, and blue. Hello. Yes. So this would be good to use on 4th of July when I go to a barbecue. Then I finally found this, which I have been wanting this for. Am I recording? <gasps> yeah, this is going to be a long video, okay? Just so you know. I've been wanting this forever, and I've only seen the, the, the red one, and I didn't want the red one because, hey, it doesn't really match my room. But this matches my room. It's sparkly, not exactly pink or gold, but good enough. And it's this, like, toiletry bag thingy like that with the pockets like that. I actually saw this first hauled on Rosa's channel, the Rose Life, her first channel, Crafty Barbie 86 and I've wanted it ever since then, but I never found it. Now I found it, and I'm so happy to have that. I could do so many things with that. Then I've got some... Oh, duh. I found some more stuff that reminds me of the 80s. Puffy stickers. Here we go. Puffy stickers. Not exactly the puffy ones we used to get back in the days. You know, your teacher would give you, like, oh, you did a good drawing or an essay or something like that, and you get a puffy sticker. Or then also, I don't remember sticker collecting. Oh my God. I always envied the girls that had the huge, like girls would have these huge binders that thick full of their sticker collection. Like, whatever. <laughs> so yeah, I always envied that, but I wasn't that great with sticker collecting. Maybe because like I didn't have as much money as them to buy a whole lot of stickers. Not the stickers were expensive, but hey, I didn't have all that much money. So, <laughs> but anyway, I wish there was a Dollar Tree back then. Was there a Dollar Tree in the 80s? I don't even know. But I didn't even start going to Dollar Tree until maybe, maybe about. <laughs> Duh, I'm thinking. Hold on. I don't know. <laughs> Eight years ago, maybe. Nine years. Whatever. Oh, my God. It's itching under this wig. Oh, my goodness. Under here, by the way, I got my hair braided, my long braided extension. So, yes, I have braid. It's in a ponytail, actually. <laughs> Anyway, but you know when you get your hair braided those of you who get your hair braided y'all know it itches and it itches like crazy This is like a weekend. Oh my god. It itches under here. Ah Okay So here's the stickers and these are like a fruit and like cakes and sweet themed stuff. So yes puffy stickers like the 80s Then we have another book pink book to add to my pink collection I have to figure out where to put the books in here because y'all know I've been collecting pink books just for decor Kind heart, fierce mind, a brave spirit. A pretty pink little mini book. And it has like, it's just this like little, you can write little things in it. 
It's all like little notes and stuff like that. I guess you could use it for artwork, tear it out, do whatever you want to do, frame it, mod podge it. But I had to have that because I collect, you know, books. Okay. Pink, very Barbie, bubblegum pink paints. I had plans to do something with this, and I'm quite sure I already have this here at my house, but because I was at my boyfriend's house, I didn't have my crafting stuff with me. I didn't get to, you know, whatever, but I bought this anyway, so, yeah. So, it's just some pretty pink, Barbie pink, I call that Barbie pink crafting paint. And then, something I really need, instant nail glue, and this says it's like the pink one, whatever. Yeah, I need to get my nails done, because I'm going to a wedding on june 4th neosporin because you know you get cut all the time at least i do because i have a kitty cat y'all know the deal if you got a cat you gotta have neosporin anywhere and everywhere and uh little snack plates 50 of them always good to have little snack plates these are the little cheapy paper ones but they're good to have we have another pink notebook i have bought this in another haul but i had to buy it again because hey i love it it's super cute it says stay wild it's kind of 80s looking, Lisa Frankish or whatever. But anyway, I had to get another one. So whether I keep it for myself or put it in a giveaway or something like that, I just had to have it. We're almost at the end, guys. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> so these facial wipes by Bolero, I absolutely love these. Um, the watermelon sweet mints, I love these. Oh, my God. Pink again. What is going on here? <laughs> but yes. Love these wipes. They smell so freaking good. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to bring that to my little overnight trip to Jersey. Um, to take my makeup, makeup off. And we also have some fabric, fabric softener sheets, dryer sheets, floral bouquet. These smell incredible. Oh, my God. Pink, of course. Yes. Yep. Nice to have. And we have a box. A really cute pink like gift box with pink and gold i love to collect these boxes to kind of like stack on the side with my other stuff with a little pink bow yes there's more dollar tree stuff in the box this super cute pink kitty like tie-dye color little change purse oh my god it's fluffy there's the inside oh my god i had to have it there's the back so they had this one had the most pink on it i really needed to have it so got that then i've got some tylenol because well at the time that i got this stuff my head was hurting a lot more because when you get your hair done you know like your head hurts so you gotta take tylenol my head's getting better <laughs> but anyway it's good to have tylenol whether or not you get your hair braided or you know you just have a headache <laughs> so extra strain tylenol that's good and we have a super cute little pom-pom. Yes, this reminds me of the 80s, specifically because of this, the little clip on top. I remember the clips back then were more like these like cheapy plastic ones. I'm not really fond of those, but these were popular clips when you had the like, keychains and stuff back in the 80s. So it was specifically the clip that reminded me of the 80s. And here's the little pom-pom, which is super cute with like these pastel ombre-ish colors. I'll put that there and oh we do have something else here we have this i finally got one of these i was just being picky because i know that they sell these in pink at but for twenty dollars at like bed bath and beyond so i'm like oh, let me just try it the jade facial roller this is heavy oh my god it's pretty i wish they had a pink one but you know they have this one i guess people like my sister says that she puts it in the fridge to be cool and she rolls it to get the wrinkles out i don't know whatever but I got it. Maybe I won't use it. Maybe I'll just put it away. But I got it anyway. I want a pink one. <laughs> and what else is in this little box? Last but not least, pink again. One of these little, like, um, little, what do you call these things? Notebook. I don't know. <laughs> I seen Rose um, call this on her channel like a while ago, and I've always wanted it. And here specifically is a pink leopard print one with the pink little rings and i think it's like one of those like little planner thingies mini planner so yeah i had to have it come on now it's pink that's it oh my god nothing else bag is empty oh. 
But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching my 80s Dollar Tree haul at home. Oh my god, I can't believe I did a video in my house. Oh my god, so happy. I know it's a long video, but hey, it was fun. <laughs> So don't forget to check out Mimi Sparkle's channel. She did um, a super cool, um, same thing, 80s themes on her channel. And I said there's other women that did this as well. Check them out too. Rose, um, of course, did this. So this was so much fun. Like, oh my God. Yeah, never mind the mess. As I said, you know, I got to clean up a girl's room. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Take care. Stay sweet. I'll see you soon. Bye. Ha <laughs> ha.